Hi there, and welcome to Simple Texting Academy. Today we're going to go over how to import contacts. Let's jump right in. First, click on the subscribers panel. Here you can add subscribers a number of different ways. Let's say we want to create a list just for employees. We'll click Add List, then give the list a name. With Simple Texting, you can have unlimited lists and unlimited contacts. If you want to add a contact manually, just click Add Contact. In order to add a contact, you must have their phone number. The rest of the info is optional. Select the list you'd like to add them to. We'll select Employees. But what if you already have a list of contacts from a CRM or elsewhere? Well, with simple texting, you can import contacts using a CSV or Excel spreadsheet. Remember, you must have express consent from all your subscribers before you message them. Click the Import Contact button and select your file. It's important that you set up your file with a header row so that you can easily map the fields. OK, choose the list you'd like to add your contacts to. Simple Texting automatically sends a best practice compliance message to the subscribers that you import. Agree to the terms and conditions and choose Next. Now it's time to map the fields. When importing contacts, you can choose to add more than just a phone number. Here you'll see we've created custom fields, including department name. You can use these custom fields to segment your messages later. Don't worry, we'll go over all of this in later videos. Click Import, and you're done. Let's say you need to edit a subscriber's info. That's easy too. Just click the three dots next to the row, and click Edit. Here you'll see we forgot Michael Scott's email. We can add it in manually, and click Save Contact. Compliance and consent are hugely important when adding contacts. If you ever have any doubts, reach out to our customer support team by clicking the chat bubble at the top right corner of your dashboard. Thanks for watching.